want to find the value of land without a mobile home on it. I want to offer land minus 5K for its removal. Do you use tax assessed value for li from listrei.com? Uh, so listrei.com, no, wrong one. All right. In my opinion, the value of land means nothing. Again, when you're selling a product or service, it's not how much the thing's worth because the value is very arbitrary. In 2006, uh, I think an acre of land in Port St. Louis was like $30,000. In 2008, 2009, it was worth like ten. Did the acreage change? Did the soil composition change? No, just the arbitrary supply and demand of it changed. Uh, so uh, that being said, the value of your land is what's, what is what a cash buyer for land is willing to pay for it. That is what the thing is worth. Now, if one cash buyer says he's going to pay 30K on it, it's not means the value of it's 30K. But if you talk to 10 cash buyers for land and they all tell you it's like worth 28, 30, 34, you have a general idea of what the land is. So that being said, just raw land, I would ask my builders how much they're looking to buy properties in the 22222 area code uh, quarter acre uh, that's looking, you know, you can build a, put a mobile home on it and just ask them. They tell me I'm paying this, what they do. They say, Zach, I'll pay $25,000 for a quarter acre, a uh, lot of land. Okay, great. I talk to a seller, lock it up for five, sell it for 25, sell it. And then make like what? 15, 20 K depending on, you know, uh, they do 25, like some lands worth more than others, but they generally pay 25. I lock up for five and make 20 K in the assignment deal on that raw piece of land. That can be your first wholesale deal. Your first wholesaling real estate deal, guys, doesn't have to be a single family property. It could be a mobile home. It could literally just be a raw piece of land. I know guys that have got their first wholesaling deals on raw pieces of land. So in my personal opinion, I truly believe that uh, the 5K, so if someone's going to pay 25, got to pay five off, that's 20. Uh, that's what I do. Tax assess is not my favorite from List REI with land. Uh, land comps aren't the best. I usually just go off of what the builder or cash buyer ends with and uh, pay for it. You go to listrei.com and pull cash sales in your area. That's probably one of the best ones to do from there. Cash sales on vacant land, uh, one of the best ones out there. So that's my personal opinion. Uh, 